Hello everyone, today I'm showing you the new Chinese for Kids learning material and how it is used. Inside this book of my colorful fruits and vegetables, there are six booklets of six different colors. I'm going to be showing you how to use one booklet, so let's my begin. book of red. So you can print it out in red, in color or in black and white. Color is recommended for teachers because you can like cut them cut the pictures up and place them around the classroom or houses. And black and white is recommended for students since they can study by themselves to make the little booklets out of it. You can see I have cut up both the books. And for the the teachers books you as you can, as I showed, told you before, this is the front page where you write this book belongs to and your name here. As you can see, we, the teachers can take these little sheets of papers with the fruits and names on them and hang them all around the class, like so. And. The students' book over here, they can write their name inside however they want to, all colorful. They can decorate the front page all over the one. And they can take the red pencil, since this is my book of red, and color it in. And after the children have finished learning the vocabulary of this little booklet, they have to staple this side here so it will turn out like an ordinary book. Now for the worksheet. The worksheet looks like this. There are two smiley faces on the worksheet. Well, not all of them. Just the one on top. The one is smiling because he likes what he has. Huan, which translates to I like. The other smiley face is not very happy with it, with what he has. So it's Wo Bu Shi Huan, which means I don't like. So on the right hand side there are lots of nice colorful pictures. And then next to that there are other characters. So don't be fooled because the characters do not match up with the pictures that are next to it. So, what you have to do is use your scissors and cut up each square and match them. You see, I have done cutting all of the little squares and here is the worksheet on the side. Now, I have to match them together. So, for example, this is a cherry. Hmm. What is cherry? Let's see. No. No. Mm, no, I don't think so. There it is. Okay. Ying Tao. Now I match them up. Now I find the apple. Let me find if I see the apple. Mm -mm, I don't think so. No. Yep, there it is. It's hiding from me. Now I take the strawberry. Let's see. Mm, no, no. Mm -mm. Uh, ah, there it is. See, he was hiding from me. So, you get the idea. It's done. So, we take back our good old worksheet over here. And, remember what this is? Remember what this is? Alright, I'll tell you. This, our the fruits or vegetables that I like. And here, I don't like it. So, let's start. I like cherries very much. So I'm going to put cherries in the I like section. I also like apples very much. So I'm going to put my apples in the I like section. I also like strawberries. So I'm going to put it in the section above as well. 
now you know how to use this little booklet all by yourself. This, remember, is one out of six. I hope this tutorial inspired you a bit to go on ChineseForKids.net. So, thank you for watching. Till next time.